all right welcome to another video the third one in the installment so far um i'd just like to start off by thanking you for the uh, positive feedback on the last two i really appreciate the views and the likes and the comments it really does uh motivate me to create more content uh today's video is about finding specific items so if you're if you want something specific i'm going to teach you how to find it well, i've got one method that most people don't know about so i'm going to teach you and we're just going to get right into it so starting now so the first method to find items is the most popular one and also the simplest one is by simply going on the fashion rep subreddit and just entering the word here that you're or of the item the name that you're looking for so for example if i was looking for uh, uh dunks right if i wanted dunks i would just put dunks just as one word and then you get all of these various posts that have that specific phrase in the title dunks 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 and you can just simply click on the post like i did here it will load agent panda by yeah sure whatever then you go 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 through the post this is a pretty good review as well so fair enough and you have the, the the shoe and now i have a link for a pair of dunks so if i was to open the link i would be redirected and i have the link to a dunk now as i've mentioned before there are various versions i don't know why this guy bought tg when there's vt and m but it doesn't matter but i mean that's pretty much the easiest way to find uh items uh, but only those if you have to, if, if you really think about it though you won't really find unique things like this because it's only going to be people that uh it's only going to be things that people bought in, in the past so yeah that's pretty much it the next method is also through the fashion rep subreddit and uh, it is slightly different in its nature you do this by going to the trusted seller list which is on the right here and it will redirect you or open up a new tab and you will get this entire contents list with various brands and then store links and agent links. So for example, if I was specifically looking for Adidas items, I would have these various options or Alexander McQueen, Amiri, whatever, the SSC. So this is another simple way of finding specific things. But then again, you can't really find unique things through this method because this is just from, from people that have already tried and tested these sellers. So you have to bear that in mind. Okay, the third method, this one is more specific to shoes. It is from this Yupu that I've spoken about recently in the other video I made. And it's specifically made for shoes. It was made by Montclair, one of the helpers. This is like the easiest way to understand which batch is good for which shoe. And I'm not the best regarding batches because I don't really have the care <laughs> to learn about it all. But let's say I wanted a uh, Jordan 1. It would redirect me here. And I, I could just by looking at here, I can tell that the, generally speaking, this link would be good. For the Lost and Fans, this link would be good. And for mockers, this would be a good link. So that's it's a very, very simple um, catalog, basically. The next method I'm going to show you is uh, relatively easy as well. I'm going to get a photo of a random item. So let, let me just do that. Okay, I've just copied the image for the Supreme Statue of Liberty jacket. Now I can go here onto Panda Buy and on the home page next to the um, search bar, you can see there's this little photo logo, I guess, image logo, whatever you want to call it. You click on that. Your clipboard shows up, your downloaded file show up. I'm going to click on the Statue of Liberty. It will redirect me. It will search. You need to stay on this page, by the way, for it to search properly. If you click off, it might uh, mess it up. So just stay on it. And now, as you can see, I've got various different uh, listings for that specific item. And this is like one of the best methods to find specific items because it, it just goes off of images. So even if sometimes, um, I don't know if you can see, it, like here it's, this is a bad example because this is a really poor replica, but um, you can see even though it's censored, it still shows up for reverse image search. So that's really good. And also I'd like to mention, if you have items that haven't been purchased on Panda Buy before, you can sometimes, I don't know if it's going to happen for this item. Sometimes you can go on the product link and go on Taobao. So yeah, this was a bad example. Uh, but sometimes when you go um, onto the original Taobao link, you actually see reviews from Chinese buyers, like from people in China buying the item. So maybe this one will have it. Yeah, here you go. So you've got photos of the product and how it looks in hand, which is really convenient because it means you can still rely on, on the word of mouth, even despite the fact someone may have not purchased it through Panda by itself. So this is another good method. The final method I have, which is one that I use quite a lot and one that isn't very well known, is something that logs one of the mods from the Fashion Reps Discord showed me. Uh, you know, him and I go way back. We used to sit in maths class together and stuff. He, I, I borrowed him my pencil, actually. But beside the point, um, this method is actually my personal favorite and i'm going to go to a private tab just because it's easier for me that way and it consists of um 
doing this basically you do site colon and then you type in wadian.com because obviously as we know wadian doesn't have a search bar right it doesn't so instead you do site colon wadian.com and then you type in a phrase or a brand or an item so for example let's just put jordan uh actually no let's do let's do burberry right so now google is going to search for every listing and every store on wadian that has burberry in the name okay and this works for anything. Site Wadey on Supreme. Boom. So many listings. 10 pages of listings, right? This is how you find unique things and unique sellers that people haven't tested before. And you can mess around with new sellers. You don't need to worry because as long as you purchase through Panda Bar, you are you do have insurance and protection. So that's a, another good thing. And this this is probably my favorite method, just because you can find so many specific things. And you can also um, add more information and more detail into your search. So let's say I wanted a Supreme and undercover, right? I would be redirected to uh, a seller or a specific item page like this enemy logo tee apparently. And here you go, public enemy. Uh, this is a bad tee, but you, you know, you get the point. It's, it's, this is like how simple it is to find items for yourself. It's really this easy. You don't need to ask on the um, WTC channels. You don't need to rely on other people. You can do everything yourself. I actually just finished recording and I forgot to mention the, the method with the way the on search bar works for other websites as well so it's not just Wadeon that it works with for example if i wanted to find something on Yupu, i could do yupu.com space and then the brand so burberry for example right and here you see i get shown various different sellers that have burberry as a catalog on Yupu. i don't even know i've never seen the seller in my life but i'm just showing you how it works i think i'm pretty sure it work with taobao as well so we'll just give it a go real quick. Taobao.com Burberry. And here you go, we have Burberry. Top 100 Burberry, top 700 Burberry, top 3000 Burberry. Bear in mind, Taobao has a lot of censorship and restrictions with how, what people can post up, which is why you most often see censored photos on there. So it might not be that helpful for, for Burberry, but it still does work. So just bear in mind that you can do this for pretty much any website. I think it might work with 1688, but I'm not sure. I'm gonna give it a go right now. Uh, yeah, I mean, as you can see, it works with 16AA as well. So it's a really nice method to find unique things that other people haven't found. Whoa, okay. I mean, yeah, but I'm just saying, if you if you need specific things or specific brands and you're, you're like head over heels for a specific brand, you can very easily use this method to find things uh, and sellers that you may have not known before. So just bear this in mind. I mean, yeah, that's pretty much it. You don't need to ask for help. You don't need to do anything. You don't need to count other people. You can do everything yourself. It's very, very easy to find items that you want specifically. And you shouldn't be asking other people because it really isn't necessary in any way. As long as you know these four things, I think it was four, then you're you're good to go, honestly. There's no there's no need for anything else. You're, you're just fine. So I, I hope that was helpful to you guys. Uh, if you have any more questions, obviously leave them in the comments or ping me on Discord. If you have any video suggestions or things you'd like to see in the future, also let me know. I really appreciate it, guys. I'll see you in the next one. Peace.